psycho-oncology and the issues that our patients face sort of cross all of our drugs and cross even patients who aren't being treated. Um, there's some really interesting data coming out looking at, at the impact of a cancer diagnosis and, and how, how do people manage that. Uh, it's almost a post-traumatic stress disorder kind of, of element that I think is, is quite common. Um, I think regardless of what the etiology is of, of the psychological complications of a cancer diagnosis, it's really important to recognize them and, and empower the patient to tell you about them. I mean, the biggest problem that we run into is our patients don't tell us. Um, uh, and to have people who you work with regularly who know, understand what these issues are in, in cancer patients in particular. You know, at, at many academic institutions, there is a group that specializes in psycho-oncology, and I think that um, as an area of, of expertise, that's an emerging one in the, in the psychological and psychiatric groups.